This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Aquarius is out here for my cross watches. This energy can be resonated. So just be a little aware that it's tuning in. Somebody can have a nine year old. Somebody can be 33. Somebody can have a five year old. Somebody can be 30. Okay, so for a lot of my Aquarius, especially for those of you that are trying to expand your brand right now, or for those of you that are trying to network or bring something new in or channel something new, we got building your world, creation, expansion, networking. So for a lot of my Aquarius, this is going to require stepping outside your comfort zone. I am seeing for those of you that are in love with somebody, we got an Aquarius that's in love with someone. You will be receiving this clarity. That illusion that's in your head will be released really soon. You will be getting the truth. For a lot of my Aquariuses, this is going to cause you to set some boundaries. Somebody could be 30, dealing with someone 30. For a lot of my Aquariuses, you're going to be setting some really high boundaries really soon. Somebody could have a two-year-old. We got some Leo energy here. For those of my Aquariuses that are dealing with a Leo, somebody could be 29. I am seeing you had a learning experience with this Leo. You gained a lot of wisdom from this situation. Now I'm seeing you putting that energy into something that's going to make you better. We got new creations and we got becoming something new. So for a lot of you, this is going to be you rebranding re yourself. This is also going to be you for those of you that are wanting to be entrepreneurs or for those of you that are wanting to possibly take a business to the next level or going to business for yourself. I'm seeing that's a big thing for a lot of my Aquariuses right now. Somebody can be 41, dealing with someone 41. Somebody can be 31. We got hostility. This is for those of you that had a hostile situation with someone recently that caused you to set those boundaries. Maybe somebody crossed the line and a lot of them felt like that you weren't going to handle something a certain way and you did. So I'm getting that's the big thing for a lot of my Aquarius right now is setting those boundaries. You and your children are watched over by loved ones. Okay, so we got an Aquarius that says this is an Aries, 31. For all my Aquarius that are worried about the safety of their children. Everything is okay. Don't worry about that. Spirit is protecting them. Angels are protecting them right now. Explore your options. Figure out what's for you and what's going to work for you. I'm getting that's the big thing for you right now. Is exploring your options and seeing what's going to work. I'm getting a lot of you trying to find yourself, especially career-wise. For a lot of my Aquarius out here, I'm seeing a lot of you guarded and protected. So don't be afraid to take a leap. Or to try something that you wouldn't normally do. What else is coming in for Aquarius right now? Let's see. We got new beginnings and a fresh start. This is something new for you. This is something that you didn't see for yourself. A lot of you don't even see this coming. You don't even believe it. Like, if I tell you, you're not going to believe me. My Aquarius just have to see things themselves. So, I guess you're just going to have to let the universe play out for you for a lot of my Aquarius. I'm getting that's the thing. A lot of you are wanting to know how somebody from the past is feeling about you. This is that past love or message to Aquarius. A lot of my Aquarius is wanting to know how this person is feeling about them right now. I wish I had treated you better. It's time for me to heal now. I love you. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. I hide behind material things. I left when I saw you with someone. I don't react when people mention you. I feel you even though we are apart. We both know I'm not the one for you. This could be a Virgo talking for some of you. This could be a Capricorn. This could be a Leo. This could be an Aries. I remember every detail of that day. I replay our conversations over and over. I want you. I will wait for a sign from you. So for a lot of my Aquarius, the reason why you haven't heard from this person is because they know you have a wall up. They know you have your guard up. They know you're not going to allow much right now. So they're scared to even approach you. I'm afraid to contact you. So many things remind me of you. I am not available. So for a lot of my Aquarius, this person has made themselves unavailable because they're scared of moving on, but they're also scared of losing you permanently. They feel like if you see them with someone else or if you end up being with somebody else, there's no chance for them. I wish things could be different. This person hates where y'all went. This person hates where y'all went. Like they hate it. They hate it really bad, Aquarius. They regret it. They regret how they treated you. They regretted how they talked to you. This could be a cancer for some of you. Somebody can have a two-year-old. We got some cancer energy here. A lot of my Aquarius has chose their self recently. Somebody could be 27. A lot of you felt like you couldn't be yourself with this person. This was a Scorpio. This is a Taurus for some of you. A lot of you felt like you couldn't be yourself. We got the hate nurtured with love. So for a lot of my Aquarius, is be careful of someone that's going a little bit too hard to portray this perfect image. They could be secretly planning to stab you in the back. I'm getting a lot of you aware of this right now. 
I do appreciate all my Aquarius. I am still doing five for five questions for Aquarius. The cash app is D E E F O N D E L. The email is derefondel at gmail.com. What's coming in for Aquarius right now is closure. Thank you, Aquarius.